The Bible, dramas, romantic comedies, stuff like that. The first time Fifty Shades of Grey came out, it was the first place. I think it's mostly like fantasy or romance, like some drama books, something like this. It certainly should not be. I think... Well, I hope not. Okay. <laughs> like, wait, for real? Huh. That's a difficult question. I think people will get interested in the topic. I think people would get interested and would buy it first. But it's still a kind of difficult topic in Germany. So, not really sure if it would be a good idea. Well, that's really bad. I'm, I'm literally, I'm speechless. I don't know what to say to that. It's just, it, I think it shows there's a big problem there. Honestly, I'm speechless. But this is harsh, like I don't know the reason, but this just sounds really harsh. I don't want to say anything about bad about Japanese people, but like from what I've heard before, like their mindset is kind of like Japan is the best land in the world, like the best country. So especially because they are fighting with Korea, books that say bad stuff about Korea are popular. So. I think it's because of their mindset, but I don't think it's a good thing because I think especially the younger generation should like be more open-minded and yeah, I think it's kind of manipulative, so... No, I've never seen it and I've never heard it from anyone in my life. Well, of course, in churches. Because we, like German people, are really religious. We have a lot of religious people. Yeah, kind of, but I cannot really relate to that. So, because I don't really mind where I'm born where I'm raised. I mean, it's of course good to live in Germany because we have a lot of uh, good economics and the politics are really good here. But, like, I think sometimes it can sound very arrogant. That they're being really racist and dumb. I don't know, I probably wouldn't find it good can be very kind of racist. Okay, so the thing is, it's okay to be proud of your nation, it's okay to be proud of your nationality, but don't think of yourself as better as other people, just because they're from other countries. No, never. I mean, we all eat different kind of foods from different countries and I personally think uh, uh, we should be open, open-minded and um, we all should share our cultures with each other and like we are all the same humans, so. We can even buy it in supermarket and like refrigerator and then just put it in microwave and eat it. No, of course I'm not. She's posting different food of countries on her Instagram and so on. Of course, wait, no, 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 that's, that's, no, that's hilarious. <laughs> it's really hilarious. No, of course I'm not angry. But if it really looks delicious, then I want to try it as well. So I will not be angry. <laughs> no. I don't think there's a reason to be angry. Like, she can eat whatever she wants. I think every person in the world should be able to do what they want and to travel where they want. 
and we should respect each other, so I don't see a problem with that. That's stupid, why should I? I eat international food all the time. It's, the world is like connected for a reason and why shouldn't you enjoy other cultures and understand other cultures and eat other food? Like, that's so stupid. That's the stupidest, stupidest, most dumbest thing I've ever heard in my life. Like literally, who can say like, now are they only allowed to eat traditional Japanese food or? That's stupid. It's just food. I think it's ridiculous because it's like a really old mindset. Like, I would understand if like some old people would think like that because they were there when war happened. But like the new generation to still think like that and harass other people just because of food or because of a hobby or something like that. I think that's not okay. And it's not that Korea is doing anything bad to Japan. So I don't understand that problem. Uh, the Japanese people were angry about it. I, I mean, I know about the history of uh, Korea and Japan, but I cannot believe it because like it's for me it's only food, even if it's Korean food. And uh, yeah, I, I think this is kind of ridiculous. Oh my God. Like I said before, I'm not Korean, but I feel so, so, wow. So offended, I feel so like, I feel so attacked. But I can't, because for German people, this is, this, this is incredibly, super, 100% hilarious. Like I, I but the, the problem is like, I know the story, like what was with Japan and Korea and so on. Be, be, like I kind of know it just slightly, but, but I don't know the reason. So I'm get, I okay, I'm getting angry because this is for German, for German people, for German mind, this is no go. This is the no. This is a no. I heard also of those story before where um, Korean people were in Japan and Japanese people uh, were saying some bad words to Korean people and I I think something happened in the past but we we should like um, try to forget the past and do things better like I want to I want to know the reason why Japan is like that to Korea and like I feel like well I suddenly be, like I suddenly get the 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 wish to be to become a politician in Japan to like stop this